Hello air signs. Welcome back to my channel, Presence of a Goddess. Thank you for joining me today. Today's video is just going to be a general message uh, Spirit has for you. If it resonates, awesome. I do appreciate if you like, comment, and subscribe. If it does not resonate, I do apologize. You can check your sun, moon, and rising. Um, if you want to book a personal reading with me, the link will be down below. Thank you, guys. So, <clears throat> when I'm getting air sign, which is my Aquarius, Gemini, my Libras, is someone is living a lie. It could be you. It could be a friend. Um, it could be a lover. Um, it could be you not expressing yourself authentically. I'm getting strong personal energy like this is personal for most of you guys. Just take it as it resonates. Trying to see what deck I should use. I'm going to use my, um, I don't even know how to say it, Kawili deck. I don't know. <laughs> so let's see what Spirit has. They actually want to use, want me to use my Kipper deck first. Just living a lie. Because I kept hearing living a lie. Community. Some of you guys could be living a lie as far as your religious views. You are now becoming spiritual, um, but your family is still a Christian or some type of religion that you grew up on, but you're breaking away from that. They could be thinking, like, you're worried that that, because I do have bad health on top, so you could be worried that they will execute you out, like, they will not accept you. Yeah, a gift. You guys could have found out you have a gift, like a spiritual gift, um, and you haven't told anyone because you're afraid because of religious review reviews, <laughs> religious views. You could have um, kept this from a lover, but you're getting kind of frustrated because you don't know how, you're, you you want to show yourself, you want to be authentic. Yeah, coffin. This is the old you. Sorry about the glare, you guys. This is the old you, the coffin card. And you're worried that people are going to view you um, differently or, like, execute you out. That's what I'm getting. I'm going to use my spirit animal deck. We got dragonfly magic. I embrace my transformation. I courageously let go of the past. The magic of nature is in me. I am brilliant and I am blessed. Dragonfly. I do want you to look up the symbolism of dragonfly. Because I do feel like there is a significance in that. You want to embrace yourself. You want to fly. You want to be... You want to become yourself, but you're afraid. You suppress yourself. It could be around some people at work, but it's really starting to bother you. Spirits is saying you need to learn how to embrace yourself authentically because once you're honest with yourself, you will not feel sick. I feel like that you're suppressing yourself to the point where you get sick. This is possible, where you are suppressing yourself and you're not being truthful to yourself. That, that manifests itself to physical ailments. What do you have for my fellow air signs? You need to really embrace your gift. You suppress your gift. You ignore your gift. You bury your gift. With the coffin card, you bury in your gift. One day, Spirit is saying, you're going to have to you're gonna have to let it out. Yeah, two of swords. Can't make this stuff up. You block your gifts. You block your true self. Um, from other people because you that to you this is protecting yourself but it's really not you're living a lie with the devil card I feel like it's to the point where some of you guys could be drinking too much um, or just doing something toxic to suppress your self medicating um, because you are trying to avoid who you are it's to the point where you're lying to other people but you're lying to yourself three of cups yeah, you're lying to friends. You're lying to your circle. You're, but Spirit is saying if they do not accept who you are, the authentic you, then you know who are, who is for you and who isn't. 
I told you, Six of Swords. It's time to heal. I feel like you are afraid to tell the truth because you're afraid that... I feel like somebody is really strict. Whoever this person is, it could be a woman um, or a male. Somebody could be a pastor. Um, and you're afraid that they are going to like... Because I feel like they already talk down to you already. Like they're very negative already. But you are brainwashed. You are you timid. You are triggered. Um, if they find out who you are. And this could be just in general to everyone. It's like a trigger to you. Because of because when you were growing up, you could have gotten bullied in school. And you just told yourself from then on, uh, I'm never going to show my true self ever again. This is for somebody. Yeah, Four of Pentacles. You said, I'm going to hold it to myself. I feel like it's not right, though. Spirit's saying it's not right. You're lying to yourself. This is just going to build chaos. This is going to build self-destruction. With the devil card, that's self-destruction. Because when you're lying to yourself, it just becomes a whole chaos. With the Nine of Pentacles, it's a lot of self-reflection, a lot of building you need to work on with yourself. You feel like you're doing the right thing, but you're not. By withholding who you are. Express yourself. Be honest. Open up that throat chakra. Because I feel like little lies turn into big lies. In all aspects of your life. Embrace yourself. I, I see somebody opening their arms. And their their um, head is like they're just embracing the wind. That's what you need to do. I feel like you feel suffocated in a box. Like in this coffin. In this coffin. You're suffocated. Spirits is saying embrace your gift. Whatever gift you have, I feel like you have a spiritual gift. With the community card, this is Spirit saying we have your back. But you have to be true to yourself. They're really disappointed. I told you, you have gifts, magician. You are very magical. It's time for new beginnings. For you to transform yourself. To embrace your transformation. I feel like when you're at home, you're yourself. But it's starting to decline though. That's what Spirit says. starting to decline. Because now you're lying to yourself. Because you're lying to others. is leading you lie to yourself. You have to face. You have to self-reflection. Face yourself. Or you're going to regret it. With the Five of Cups, you're going to regret it. If you do not be truthful, stand your ground. You think that people are really going to, I feel like you're going to help people, inspire people with the six of wands. And I feel like you you suppress yourself online too. Like you're afraid to speak up about your spirituality online. Spirit saying you need to because people are watching you that need that inspiration. You are a success. You will be a success story. But you're holding yourself back with the four of swords. You need to really embrace your um, your thinking. You really need to get into... You see these headphones? I feel like Spirits are saying you need to listen to meditation music. And that's how you're going to get your messages and your downloads. It's through meditation and music. DNA repair meditation music. You have to start healing yourself. And start being honest with yourself so you can be honest with others. But open up your throat chakra. Yeah, this is supposed to happen. The hair font. You see, this is religious views. Definitely religious views. Somebody is having religious views differences with their family or their friends or people at work. But spirits are saying, speak up. Yeah, it's getting boring. It's getting boring. You're getting tired of it. I feel like you're getting tired of it. You don't know what to do. But spirits are saying right now, what I'm saying right now, you need to speak up or you're going to regret it. This is your energy. You see how sad he look? But I also feel like with the King of Swords, Spirits is just saying, stay in your ground. Stay in your truth. Make up your mind on what you want to do for yourself. Because I do feel like you want to be honest and embrace your gifts and to be more spiritual. But you withhold that because you're afraid of what people will say. But nobody cares, Spirit said. Nobody cares. Because either way it goes, a tower card will happen if you avoid your mission, your truths. I'm going to pull one more Kippa card deck. Yeah, you're confused. 
The full moon is coming. Spirits are saying do a candle manifestation with a white candle. Expectation. I feel like you're not expecting. I feel like you're worried about what people are going to say. Spirits say who gives a damn? Because this is going to hurt you in the long run. If you do not stop suppressing who you are. All right, air signs. That's the message I have for you. I hope this resonated. Um, thank you for watching. If you are feeling this video, I appreciate if you like, comment, and subscribe. Thank you guys. Appreciate you. Till next time.